let's really look at something here. A big, big problem that could have been fixed. I know I go on and on about things wrong with movies, but let's look at one of the biggest solutions this film could have had. What if the movie started with the court case? Oh, not the stupid trip and there's a power outage case. I mean the other court case they talked about. Them getting sued for the damages caused by Stay Puff. Think about it. There'd be no more ghosts because Gozer was gone, so they'd still be down on their luck when being sued. Even Winston could be there with them. In fact, them saying their other jobs might actually be funnier than seeing them. What's your occupation? I host the public access show World of the Psychic. What's your occupation? I measure anger by giving and taking away puppies. What's your occupation? Birthday parties. Birthday parties. That surprisingly would have been funnier. It could even take place five years later because they were forming the case around them. Hell, a lot of articles nowadays point out that Walter Peck was actually right about how friggin' illegal their operation was. In fact, have him there. He can be a witness or even the prosecution. That way you wouldn't need Watered Peck to hate him for no reason because his hatred is already justified. Just as they're about to be found guilty, the other two ghosts pop up. But wait, Gozer is gone. Where did these two come from? Suddenly there's a mystery. The same thing happens. The judge receives the order, Winston is with them to bust the ghosts, and maybe seven minutes in, this is our intro. The last, the beautiful, the only Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters! Over a half an hour of bullshit filler gone. And how cool of an introduction would that be? When Janine answers the phone saying, Yes, we're back. The other end wouldn't be going, What the hell freaking took ya? And the rest, you can still kind of do a similar thing. Follow up with Oscar's carriage being possessed, only this time, it's Peter and Dana's baby. You don't have to redo the romance, in fact, the intensity is up because it's both their kid now. Adding a new element to their characters and taking their relationship to the next step. Maybe Dana is like, screw this, no ghost is taking my kid, I'm becoming a goddamn Ghostbuster. If newcomer Winston could do it, why not her? Then Tolly and Janine could look after Oscar like they originally have, and we'd have Ripley as a goddamn Ghostbuster. Adding a great dynamic to the group rather than... Boy, this equipment's heavy. Oh yeah, that happens in this. That's so much time you can dedicate to more gadgets, more ghosts, more vehicles, more characters, more shit you can sell as toys that also make the film more interesting. New stuff! Furthering the story. There! I fixed the movie! Combining new elements with old elements and furthering the idea.